Hey, this chip coming at you with the next Team Chip Minute. This week we're going to talk about something we kind of think of as a Team Chip-ism. It's something that we work with our team on all the time. And the word this week is newness. New is in brand new with ness on the end of it. Newness. You know, when you get something and uh, you know, your brand new pair of tennis shoes and you don't want to get dirt and mud on them and, and you're real careful to tip over all, all the dirty spots on the floor and you know, tip over the water holes and so on. And then after a week or two, they're starting to get dirty in three weeks, you're just wearing them for anything and everything. And you forget what it was like when they were new, because now they're not new anymore. Like that brand new car you get, and you tell the kids, don't eat in the back seat. No food, no trash, no messiness in my new car. I'm not gonna have a mess in my new car. But after about a month, two months, six months, you start to look around and you find a little Johnny in the back seat drop his french fries between the seats, and you're going, oh, well, it's okay. It's just a car. Well, what happened? What happened to the newness? Where did the newness go? And, and what we do, the, 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 the realm we think of that in with our team is training. You know, when you first learn a new kick, you learn a new punch, you learn a new exercise of some sort, it's very exciting, it's new, and you want to do it over and over and over and over, and you're like, oh, I love it because it's new, and after a thousand times, it's not new anymore. And so we have to find creative ways to bring back the newness. We become, as instructors, we like to think we become masters of disguising repetition to maintain newness. Well, it's the same with the, new, with the job. It's the same with a family sometimes. It's the same with, you know, going to church. You know, it's, it's fresh, it's, it's cool, it's, it's exciting for a while, but then the newness begins to wear out. Well, you have to reach down deep and find out your why. Why are you doing it? Find your passion and dig deep to find the newness. Maintain the newness and keep that mindset. I'm going to keep this fresh and new as long as possible so that I can stay excited about it. So I want to encourage you in every area of your life to go out there and find and maintain the newness. Keep it fresh so you can maintain your passion and do a great job at it. So reach out there, dig deep, and find your newness. Now I'm going to look you in your eye and tell you you are awesome.